not just a provocative or vector's model fashionista and the last. As a publisher and a food editor, eating right has always been an obsession for me. I must confess, though that I break the rules very often, before falling back in line rather sheepishly. However, there is no denying that in this day and age, when discussions on lifestyle related disorders occupy a considerable space in newspapers, magazines, TV channels, and the social media, it becomes doubly important to be attuned to our body, heed its distress signals, be mindful of its well-being. I feel very honored to launch my first book, Keep Eating, Keep Losing, together with my publisher of Books International. Thank you, RJ. Well, this book has been a manifestation of my own story, my passion for healthy food, and my desire to encourage each and every one of you to just give a bit more importance to your body. You know, guys, Warren Buffett once said, you have only one mind and one body. And the same words you will have to use once you are 20, 40, 60, 80, and if you are lucky, 100 or so. So, take care of your body and maximize the potential. But I'm sure you will agree to me. And it's very often, it happens that, uh, you know, we will get, give all the importance to our form rather than to our body. However, I believe that if you give importance and if you invest in your health, it's as beneficial as if you are investing as education. Because without either of them, nothing can be done. So I have written Keep Eating, Keep Losing in order to assist people to reorganize their life and make healthy eating a part of your daily routine without struggle, no worry, without and putting any special efforts. So my book is basically um, based on three components, which is healthy eating, exercise and rest, which I believe are very intimately connected together. You know guys, it is like marriage. You can't cheat and expect it to work, right? So likewise, you have to give importance to your diet, activity and a proper rest simultaneously. Otherwise, what will happen? Yeah, your body will divorce you one day. <laughs> Well, if you ask me to describe my book, just in one sentence, I would say, keep eating, keep losing is like a map, which you need once you get lost in the maze. And to be more specific, many people will get right now, nowadays, you know, confused with all the information overload which is happening, so many myths, so many tips, so many theories. You just really don't know what to believe and you're confused what to follow. So in order to make your life a bit more simple, I have written the book to show you what benefits healthy eating will give you so you can follow it very, very easily. All right, I think before my speech sounds more like a lecture than a launch book speech, I should stop here and um, thank few people uh, as I feel such gratitude for support and encouragement I received. I think I feel very, very blessed because all of you lovely people who are here today uh, have stood by me and believed in me throughout the journey. So the list is a bit of long, so please bear with me. <laughs> well, firstly, I would like to thank RJ Mango and All Books International for believing in me and my message. Thank you so much for giving Keep It In, Keep Losing the Daylight and giving me a beautiful platform to share my thoughts. Thank you so much, Ajay. Without you, my dreams would never come true. Thank you. A very special thanks to my chief guest, Sunil Shetty. For taking his precious time out. And I know how busy schedule you have, so still you have come here to launch my book. Thank you so much. You are not only the hero for all of us, but the fitness inspiration for, for many. And um, I would like to really thank you for the support you gave me and um, for giving my book the possibility to reach all the audience, <laughs> which is thank you. Also a special thanks to Sanakshi Sinha, who has written the forward for my book. Thank you so much, Sona, for believing in me, for loving the concept and recommending it to the world. She couldn't be here today, but uh, the first book is already with her. Thank you so much.
Well, a uh, moment of honesty, I could not have taken the entire credit of keep eating, keep losing to myself. Anand and Nita, where are you? Anand, Nita, love you guys. One of them, they have planted, yeah, they have planted the seed of writing this book inside my head. And without both of you guys, this journey would have never started. So thank you so much for supporting me and encouraging me throughout this journey. And I must say just one thing, keep eating, keep losing is as much yours as it is mine, guys. Love you so much. Thanks. Uncensored for actually giving my book the UI certificate <laughs> and uh, actually for hosting us today. Thank you so much for the lovely hospitality, Rahul. Uh, I would like to thank all my special guests, be it Ellie, who I think is still on the way, but <laughs> she came to support, be it uh, Rohit, be it Priyanka. Be it Garima, be it all my lovely friends, be it uh, Sunita, I mean, oh God, I don't want to miss anyone. Uh, Maria, yes, my lovely girl, thank you so much for coming here supporting me. Um, a big thank to my um, PR people. Name Tatas, I love you guys, you have done a great job. Thank you so much for your Raj Entertainment Private Limited, who has coordinated. And uh, uh, thank you so much for support. Thank you, thank you to Yoshita who has dressed me up and made me look so pretty, some modesty. <laughs> thank you to Tanaya, my makeup and hair stylist, who is at the same time the biggest foodie I know. Where are you, Tanaya? Yeah, yeah, that's the foodie. <laughs> I am coming, I'm coming to that. <laughs> and yeah, special thanks to all this love. Love you so much and I, you are really, really missed today. I just wish you could have been here. And to all those lovely people who I have missed out, yeah, thank you so much. <laughs> really know you, he's doing a great job. Uh, and for all the rest of the lovely people who I have missed out, thank you so much for all the support. Raja, Chandra, guys, uh, yeah, yeah, bye. Love you. Bye. Oh, I'm unveiling the cover. Then we have the cover here to unveil it officially and obviously speak few words. Dada, still well, indeed, that time we walk with the PCT, 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 Claudia, I think it's a very, very special day for her. She's someone, even when we used to shoot, when we shot for honor, every time she spoke about, she spoke about food, she spoke about health, uh, which is outstanding. It's something that I very, very strongly believed in. And uh, you know, uh, I think there can't be a better book than Keep Eating, Keep Losing, because that's exactly what we all want to do. You know, we're fed up of dietitians telling us how to eat, what to eat. Uh, I believe in this book more so because you've seen Claudia uh, all through her career. This little girl who come, came from Europe and then settled in India, made it a home and uh, has been ex accepted by the people that says a lot itself and uh, has remained fit through her life. Uh, so when an author of a book uh, you know, is as fit as uh, she's trying to, uh, what she's trying to promote, I think it works brilliantly. Uh, Eating is basically, I, I follow my personal example of, uh, you know, being at the age I am and uh, I strongly believe that 70% of your training is food. Uh, it's what we eat that makes the difference. First of all, 70% is uh, basically about us mentally preparing ourselves to believe that, yes, we can uh, get fit and all of us have been God gifted with good bodies. It's only that we don't work towards it. 70% of that like I said, is mind. Out of that 30%, 70% is food. And then is the, the kind of training that we do. So I believe uh, you know, this book is a book that will help you all. And uh, congratulations. I'm sure it will reach uh, every home. Uh, you know, someone who believes in good health is, it, it's very simple. Someone who believes in good health is someone who gets up in the morning, opens the window and says, good morning, God. And someone who's not into fitness, 
stretches, wakes up, opens that window and says, good God, it's morning. That's the difference. It's a very simple line. So it's up to you what mood you get up with. If you believe and get up in that mood, this book will work for you and everything that you do will work for you. So thank you. Thank you for having me here and uh, all the best. God bless. You know, uh, make sure you sell a zillion books. Yeah. Thank you. I think uh, what better option? Keep eating, keep losing. I think it's a fantastic thing. Everybody loves to eat. It's it's. Uh, I think it's how we eat and what we eat uh, that makes the difference. Uh, something that looks good uh, from a from an author's perspective, and uh, will uh, will I'm, sh I'm sure it'll work. So uh, early to bed, early to rise. No, other than that, breakfast like a king, lunch like a uh, prince, dinner like a pauper. Uh, I make sure it's it's basic math. Two plus two makes four. And you know the calories that you uh, burn are the general calories that you want to eat. So if you know your portions of food right, I don't think uh, it's a major problem. And of course, you at least need to put half an hour of a workout. It could be anything. It doesn't have to be necessarily the gym. It could be a walk. It could be skip. It could be a swim. It could be a sport. It could be yoga. But something that you need to do to make sure that you burn that those calories. Of course, हमारे हमेशा आइडल रहे हैं, whether it was Burt Reynolds or whether it was Arnold Schwarzenegger. अगर वेट ट्रेनिंग की पॉइंट ऑफ़ व्यू से देखे, तो हमेशा मुझे इंस्पायर किए, you know, Arnold Schwarzenegger ने. अगर आप आप मार्शल आर्ट्स और आउटडोर ट्रेनिंग की बात करें तो ब्रूस ली ने इंस्पायर किया व्हेन आई वाज ग्रोइंग अप अगर स्पोर्ट में कोई था तो क्रिकेट में अगर कोई था तो इट वाज विविन रिचर्ड्स आई एम सेइंग फ्रॉम अ फिटनेस पर्सपेक्टिव आप विविन रिचर्ड्स के फोर आर्म्स देखे उनकी बॉडी लैंग्वेज जो थी तो आई थिंक अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल हैव इंस्पायर्ड मी वाइल आई थिंक ओवरऑल वेलनेस में बोलता हूँ बाइसेप से ऑफकोर्स शुरू हुई थी एक जमाना था जब बिग वॉज इन उसके बाद स्लिम होना फिट था आज अगर आप आप फंक्शनल ट्रेनिंग करते हो बाहर फिज ट्रेनिंग करते हो और स्पोर्ट कोई स्पोर्ट खेलते हो आई थिंक उसे फिटनेस कहा जाता है सो इट्स मोर अबाउट वेलनेस देन फिटनेस एंड एंड जस्ट बाइसेप्स वेरी वेरी सैड आई थिंक यू नो एक बहुत ही अच्छे इंसान एक्स्ट्रॉर्डिनरी ह्यूमन बींग कहूँगा और उतने ही बढ़िया एक्टर वेन इट केम टू कॉमेडी और एनी थिंग आई थिंक रजाक भाई वॉज आउटस्टैंडिंग May God bless his soul and you know condolences to the family. Oh, well, I would like to say that I'm very proud of her and I'm very, very happy for her. Um, I was really glad when she sent me this. Uh, so really, like, amazing. I'm really happy for Claudia and we are here to support the, the book launch. I think uh, we've come for Claudia. Claudia is uh, an amazing nutritionist. I don't think a lot of people know that, yeah. that she actually is an amazing nutritionist. Working with her, she would always help us. Um, with uh, like on a movie that I worked with her just recently, she was always like, "Eat this, don't eat this," and she knows what she's talking about, which is really important. Um, that's why we had to come and support the the cause. And I think if it's a book she's written and you guys follow what she's saying, you're all gonna look fabulous, just like her, um, and also like Ellie. Well, you know, it's all about combining the both. You know, so you have to combine your exercise with your diet, what you are eating. Yes, I love it. She actually was the girl. I was with her, and she was watching the trailer and losing it. She was, and then she she tweeted it. She was like, I love this. I love this. I love Annie this. was actually trying to have a conversation with me, and I was like, I was like, listen to me. And she's like, no. Shut up. So the trailer is on. <laughs> Nothing else, just the Dan trailer. It was amazing. It was really good. I think the film is going to be epic. Yeah, it's going to yeah, be epic. Yeah. Um, wh one more thing I want to say about fitness is that I recently lost my fitness goals, and now I'm going back on it. I'm actually doing a fat to fit story, so I'm going to make sure that I consult Claudia on it and make sure that I also become rippling six packs for my next show. No, I said that. 